This video is sponsored by GoDeal24, which basically is an online store who are in the business of selling 100% legit and official softwares and game products at really low prices. Purchasing codes via GoDeal24 isn't a tedious job, and to be honest, it's really easy and quick going process. So make sure you check them out and also use the code GOP45 to get 45% off your Windows 10 Pro key purchase. Hey, it's Abel Buff and welcome back to the channel and in this video, I'm going to show you how even you can use AirDrop on Windows PC. So without a further ado, let's roll the video. So we all know that being able to airdrop files between iPhones, iPads and Macs without using the Wi-Fi or cellular data is one of the biggest advantages of being in the Apple ecosystem. Being able to transfer between iDevice and Windows PC wasn't possible until now. But now, we do have a solution for this. So in order to airdrop files from Apple devices to Windows PC, you need to make use of a website called snapdrop.net. And since there's no app for this one, I've created a bookmark on my iPhone for easy access. So open Snapdrop on both the devices, that's iDevice and Windows PC so that the name of devices shows up. So to begin with how Snapdrop works, let's try transferring photos and videos from iPhone to PC first. To transfer it, click on the PC icon that appears on the iPhone. Next up, choose the source of photo and video. Once done, just select the photos and videos that you want to transfer to the PC, following which tap Add. Soon after you tap Add, the process of transfer will begin and in no time, the transfer will get completed. And you will be also able to see the transfer data on the PC and clicking Save will save it. Similarly, you can use Snapdrop to transfer data from Windows PC to an iDevice. The steps are similar to the previous one, just the source and the target device for this one are flipped. To conclude this up, all I can say is that Snapdrop is the easiest and the most effective alternative to Apple's AirDrop making transferring data from iDevice to Windows PC and vice versa possible. So with that being said, this is Apple Buff signing off. Catch you in the next one. Till then, peace.